Prime Minister Modi is on a two-day visit to UAE to attend the UN Climate Conference COP28 in Dubai starting this week, underlying the country's commitment to the issue of climate change. Prime Minister Modi will be in UAE for two days from November 30th to the 1st of December. Prime Minister Modi is also expected to hold bilateral meetings with some of the leaders participating in this uh, summit. They obviously include the Israeli President Isaac Herzog, UN Secretary General Antonio Guterres and the newly elected uh, Maldivian President is also going to be there. The Prime Minister will hold, hold meetings with global leaders and participate in special events aimed at furthering climate action. He received a warm welcome by the Indian diaspora in UAE, which was obviously anticipating that the Prime Minister is going to be one of the key people to uh, sign some of these commitments at COP28. Mr. Sanjeev Shivastav, international affairs expert, joins us on the show to talk more about this. Mr. Shivastav, if you can hear me, sir. Yes, yes, Vinit, yes. Well, this is you. also happening at a critical juncture. Don't you feel, Mr. Shivastav, you know, global emissions uh, have uh, continued to surge. And the prime example of this surge is also, you know, the way North India has been dealing with pollution and the climate, climate crisis. Yes, uh, Vinit, I think uh, climate uh, crisis is a reality, uh, whether it is in India or uh, other parts of the world. Uh, in India, you just mentioned about uh, the kind, kind of uh, pollution-related problem uh, we have been facing here, in, uh, right here in Delhi and other places. In, uh, in, if you go to the Americas, uh, uh, they have been facing the uh, crisis of uh, floods and, uh, and the various kind of other uh, natural uh, disasters, which are obviously being caused by the uh, climate uh, change. And uh, if you uh, go to the, our neighboring country, uh, uh, Pakistan, uh, we have, uh, we have, they have uh, faced a severe uh, flood situation and the thousands and thousands of uh, uh, Pakistani people have suffered uh, recently. And uh, in uh, several other parts of the world, you know, weather patterns are changing. And the region uh, behind such, uh, you know, uh, change uh, are obviously the rising, you know, uh, pollution level, the carbon emissions are on the rise. And, uh, and uh, global temperatures are rising, and that is causing a lot of, uh, you know, uh, concerns and a lot of changes in the environmental, uh, in, in environment and weather patterns. So I think to keep the global temp temperature below 1.5 degree centigrade, which was what uh, was the aim uh, of the Paris, uh, Paris Climate Deal in 2015, uh, is certainly a, a very a big challenge. And, and, and for to achieve... Uh, that goal, I think it is important for the, all the countries of the world, it is a collective responsibility uh, to take, you know, concrete measures uh, so that this uh, the fight against uh, climate change is done efficiently and successfully. And uh, it, it is an existential crisis, we need. Uh, as of today, uh, there is no uh, planet B, and uh, this is the only planet which we have to, uh, to maintain and uh, we have to, if we have to survive, uh, as, as humanity, I think this uh, crisis must be taken up very, very seriously. And for to do, uh, this kind of uh, meetings are so enormously important. And uh, what, uh, with regard to the uh, leadership, uh, to the uh, fight against climate change concern, India is providing you know, very proactive and responsible leadership. Our Prime Minister, Narendra Modi, has emerged as a visionary leader uh, in fight against climate change. And at those uh, critical points when the United States of America had come out of the Paris climate deal, they, it was Prime Minister Modi and several other world leaders, they provided the leadership to the world in those uh, critical years. So I think India's commitment with regard to a uh, fight against climate change is concerned with it. It is a state force. It is uh, 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 very much, uh, you know, we are committed to uh, do our best. Uh, to deal with this uh, crisis because, you know, we believe in the idea of uh, Vasudhev Kutumbakam and as I said, that it is the question of the existence of our, you know, Vasudha, that is Earth, the planet Earth. So I think this uh, uh, crisis uh, uh, is very much uh, uh, very well understood by our Prime Minister in you know, Modi ji and, uh, and uh, he is doing his best to, you know, deal with this uh, crisis and providing his uh, guidance and leadership. 
uh, to the uh, uh, international community. And uh, when uh, Prime Minister Modi is going to speak in this, you know, after uh, COP28 meeting, uh, he'll, he will certainly uh, come up with a, a greater ideas and, uh, and a further action plan uh, with regard to fight against uh, climate crisis. So I think India's commitment is uh, very much uh, visible and uh, I think India is going to play a very responsible role, a visionary role in uh, fight against climate change. For more such videos, subscribe to the NewsX YouTube channel, hit the bell icon.